drive really hard in there, supplies. Uh, I had it set at very low air pressure. There was only one bar to start with. So it wouldn't matter having too much air pressure. We continue to feed it in the screw press. Take quite a bit of control to get a screw press to work right on this. I want to make sure this kick doesn't purge out on me. That is, if it breaks, it could start purging. But uh, anyway, we've got samples of pressed cake. Interesting. Yeah, for the press liquor. Oh, oh man. We're collecting samples of the press liquor here. Uh, from this is from the thick cake. So we're operating essentially with a, a fixed orifice in the cone. It's wide open. Uh, and we could set a press to run this way. We do need, need for this cone to float in and out in case something soupy happens here. We want to be able to. Uh, Close the door, close the cone. You can have this cone rotate with a stripper pin on it, and it'll break up this material. So, a rotating cone option would be a good one for this one right now. I'll say that for uh, Vincent's record. This is the uh, 4th of February 2015. We're at Vincent Corporation in Tampa, Florida. Uh, we just finished one test, and we're going to give this rubber crumb rubber one more shot test we were running was interesting we had a 55 gallon drum a sample dilute sent into us we filtered it in our Vincent fiber filter machine pouring it in here and into a 31 micron sleeve that made us some sludge samples of thick sludge thin sludge filtrate anyway we then poured that in the press cake. It was a white material we were running, and we've left some in the press. We'll force it out with the crumb rubber if we're lucky. You can go ahead and turn it on, Bill. Okay. Going backwards. Okay. Now we're going forward. And here comes some crumb rubber. This uh, screen is 15 to, uh, to pushing the cake out. It is a screen is 15 to 20 thousandths opening for one uh, we ran last month, a week ago. Um, press liquor. That's a good flow of press liquor if it keeps up. Well, uh, it's a little hard to say. Press liquor has diminished. See the stream is not steady there. It's a little broken up. And we're not getting any cake out over here on this side. Um, yeah, it looked good there for a moment. And then that stream blinded over. Um, we did push out a little, about a quarter of an inch of material there. But um, the screen's blinded over. The material is co-rotating inside the press. And um, we're not making the press cake. We just turn the press on and run backwards. And usually when you run it backwards, if you clear the screen, you see a stream of press liquor come out, even though you're running backwards. And um, so now we're turning it on and going forward again. And, uh, you know this uh, reversing technique did not wipe the screen clear. We didn't solve the blinding. Okay, 
getting a little more here. Yeah, we're getting some sludge through the screen here. Okay. We're, we're just forcing it through the screen without making any cake. We're not, the cake's not coming out. You want to poke that cake or is it? Yeah, I can do that. Okay. And inside. Okay, this chemical white stuff has gotten hard, so that could be part of our problem. We'll break it loose. I can see it's breaking loose because the cone is slipping into the shut position. I'll open the cone. Well, we're still not getting any action. There we go. Screen. There's some muck coming out. It doesn't look like it's really formed a cake. Clear the old Okay, it's pushing the cake out. Getting stuff through the screen. Well, once we got rid of the block discharge, we're getting some action here. And you see it going down here. I, I think it just fills that void the screen. Yeah. Oh, I still got fresh cake coming out. Okay. Not a whole lot, but it's coming out. What? Yeah. Let's, let's stop the press for a minute. Try to press it now? No, I open the cone, we'll get the rest of the uh, white stuff out. Okay, we're collecting some cake, and uh, Andrew is collecting pressed liquor down here. And uh, so we're getting some separation. Um, we're probably not getting that there's much solids through the screen. Looks bad, but it's uh, accumulated stuff. The flow of liquid going out is uh, not a milkshake. It's uh, fairly fluid. We're channeling. We need the rotating cone in the option in this press. Throughput seems low, but um, anyway, we know we can repeat this. Well, I thought I'd gotten out of having to put this video on uh, YouTube. Uh, it's feeding slowly, but we uh, are getting consistent results. Press liquor, uh, not that bad. Steady stream of press cake. Uh, we're collecting samples of the press liquor and um, press cake to send to you um, in case this is what you want to do. At 45 PSI instead of uh, 15, uh, we're getting dirtier press liquor. I can see it sort of the way it looks, and we're not getting any press cake. Um, so this is a uh, that type of operation. Press cake started coming out finally. Very little. Uh, we're probably getting more solid through the screen than we are through here.